Hello, good. Whoops. Hello again to video number two. And this is card number two that we make in class. So this one, um, this entire piece is stamped with uh, Rissamak, um watermark um, ink. And then I put golden embossing powder on it and heat set it. So um, it's nice in texture. It's glittery. It's just pretty. And the stamp set is also from the October, no, um, September, October catalog. But you still should be able to get this. It's B1769, Good Tidings of Great Joy. And this is the stamp set, so it's a really pretty one. Okay, let's get going. So this is our sample card. You have everything you need in your little envelope. Just pull everything out. Make sure that you have the card the right way and there's glitter everywhere, but it's Christmas. Hey, um, I made little doodles here uh, just with a black pen. It's optional, you don't have to do that. So this is the inside, so it's facing the right way. So this is my front and we will start by adhering the red first. And this is a square, so you don't have to worry about one side being longer than the other. And you just place it so there's a nice even space around. We can adhere our green with the golden embossed stamp on it. And same thing, nice and centered. And you can use your um, adhesive runner, it's up to you. Instead of smushing it over from the front. I like to just flip them over and do it this way so I don't rub off all the glitter even so the glitter is everywhere. Um, here's our bottom piece and this gets adhered. Oops. Like I said I've been working today all day with craft so I'm glittered, inked, and glued everywhere anyway okay so this should fit right on the bottom here and line up with either side and leaving a nice space again on the bottom so it's similar to the top if you happen to have a little gap there don't worry i just want to make it even to the top here because the next thing you're going to put on is our white glitter paper and this just goes right over the, the seam here. And there you have it. Now, the next thing we want to put on is our green. And that's just eyeballing it where it might go. Doesn't need a lot of glue, it's such a delicate piece. I'm just inking up a little, inking, <laughs> gluing it up a little bit. And it holds very well on paper. The glitter paper, anything you adhere to the glitter paper, you might just wanna um, hold your, hold it down for a second until it binds. It's a little bit tougher to work with. And for sure there, I would use a liquid glue. Okay, so here we're just going to put a couple dots of glue and this gun goes right on top. And then this one goes, oops. Need some more glue. some glue on the back here and I only use a lot because like I said it's gonna go over this glitter paper here 
and I want to make sure it sticks to it. And while this is drying, I'm going to take my little red dots. Well, and there's no right or wrong way to put them down, just adhere them so they stick. And the last one, if you have tweezers, that might help. Last one's gonna go on here, and there you have it. Now, for those who would like to do the doodling on the inside, let me find the right pen here. So I just did a little Christmas tree. And... little line and this one seems to get empty and then we have a little star stars are always harder to do at least for me and another little scroll to you And there you have your second part from this month's card class. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you back here for card number three. Bye-bye.